हाउ टू फिक्स विंडोज अपडेट एरर जीरो एक्स एट जीरो वन डबल एट थ्री जीरो सिक्स हेलो फ्रेंड्स फॉलो द स्टेप्स टू फिक्स द एरर अपेयरिंग ड्यूरिंग डाउनलोडिंग और इंस्टॉलिंग विंडोज अपडेट फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल मॉडिफाई सर्विसेज क्लिक ऑन सर्च टाइप सर्विसेज क्लिक ऑन सर्विसेज लुक फॉर एप रेडिनेस दिस वन राइट क्लिक ऑन दिस सर्विस सिलेक्ट प्रॉपर्टीज स्टार्टअप टाइप मस्ट बी ऑटोमेटिक हेयर इफ इट इज नॉट ऑटोमेटिक क्लिक ऑन दिस ड्रॉप डाउन एंड सिलेक्ट ऑटोमेटिक सर्विस स्टेटस इज स्टॉप्ड सो क्लिक ऑन स्टार्ट सर्विस स्टेटस मस्ट बी रनिंग टू इंस्टॉल ए विंडोज अपडेट क्लिक ऑन अप्लाय क्लिक ऑन ओके राइट क्लिक ऑन द एपरेडनेस सर्विस सिलेक्ट री स्टार्ट राइट क्लिक ऑन बैकग्राउंड इंटेलिजेंट ट्रांसफर सर्विस डू द सेम विथ दिस सर्विस सिलेक्ट प्रॉपर्टीज चेंज द स्टार्टअप टाइप टू ऑटोमेटिक एंड क्लिक ऑन स्टार्ट क्लिक ऑन अप्लाई क्लिक ऑन ओके राइट क्लिक ऑन द बैकग्राउंड इंटेलिजेंट ट्रांसफर सर्विस सिलेक्ट री स्टार्ट देन लुक फॉर क्रिप्टोग्राफिक सर्विसेज दिस वन राइट क्लिक ऑन दिस सर्विस सिलेक्ट प्रॉपर्टीज change the startup type to automatic if it is not and click on start if it is stopped if the service status is showing already running then leave it as it is click on apply click on okay right click on the cryptographic services select restart then go to windows update this one right click on this service select properties change the startup type to automatic if it is not click on start click on apply click on okay close the services window then go to settings for this click on start select settings select windows update and click on check for updates see if the update is installed without error if the issue still persists uninstall any third party programs such as optimization tool or third party antivirus the bloater can also interfere with windows update process so uninstall the tool right click on start select install apps find third party antivirus if installed to be fair i have not installed third party antivirus i am showing you an example how to install if you have third party antivirus installed suppose this is a third party antivirus then click on three dots click on an install on the confirmation pop up again click on an install click on yes if user account control dialog pops up follow the on screen instructions if any an installation wizard appears also if any optimization tool is installed uninstall this in the same way then restart your computer and check if the update is installed if the error is still occurring then reset windows update cache to reset windows update cache you can use a downloadable file 
go to the description of this video and click on this link this will download a zip file in your default browser click on the download icon and click on show in folder select extract all select extract right click on this batch file and select run as administrator click on yes press any key to continue Again press any key to continue on your keyboard. Restart your computer. And then check if the update is installed. Alternatively, you can use these commands from the description to reset Windows update cache. Click on search, type cmd, right click on command prompt, select run as administrator, click on yes, copy the first line of command, paste into the command prompt, press enter, copy the second line, paste into the command prompt, press enter. Copy the third line, paste into the command prompt, type Y and press enter. Copy the fourth line, paste into the command prompt, press enter. In the same way, run all these commands and uh, then restart your computer then check for updates corrupted system files may also trigger this error code 0x801 so repair them for this click on search type cmd select run as administrator click on yes Go to the video description and run these two commands. This is system files checker command. This will uh, repair corrupted system files and uh, this is DISM restore health command. This will repair installation image. Copy the system files checker command. Paste onto the command prompt and hit enter. Copy the DISM restore health command. Paste onto the command prompt. Hit enter. Once completed, close the command prompt, close the all other running tasks, and uh, restart your computer. Then check for updates. If the update is downloaded, restart your computer and complete the installation. If any method is not working, then you will have to perform in place upgrade. Launch a browser. Type Windows 11 download. Press enter. Click on this link. Download Windows 11. 
go to the download windows 11 disk image iso for x64 devices click on select download select this option click on download now select the product language make sure that you are choosing correct product language click on start settings time and language language and region english united states is the windows display language click on choose one drop down select english united states click on confirm click on 64 bit download let the download complete once done open file explorer go to downloads right click on the downloaded iso file select mount click on open on the open file security warning dialog right click on the setup.exe file select open click on yes and check this option I want to help make the installation better this will take more time so you can uncheck this uh, option click on next select accept on applicable notices and license terms window this process will check for updates and show you an install button here click on that button to install the update without any hustle that's all friends thanks for watching the video